So here's the boss battle branch. This is it guys. <laughs> I wonder what the boss is gonna be like. Oh my god, is that Minecraft Steve? <laughs> is that the boss I have to fight? No, don't make me fight Steve. Me need pick. <laughs> Do I make you a pickaxe? Me break big dumb stone. <laughs> I guess Steve is pretty small brain. You give pick. Yeah, do I have to craft a pickaxe? I cannot punch the tree. What you wait for? I wait for survival mode. Oh, chest. Open chest. Okay, I have an axe. Oh, so I can mine wood now. You get axe? Yes, I get axe. Yay! <laughs> Those low-pitched villager sounds are pretty funny, not gonna lie. Break tree, get wood. You make pick, me need pick. Stone pick, break dumb stone. Actually, wood pick also breaks dumb stone. You dumb Steve. Me wait. So you need a stone pick, even though wooden pickaxe would still work. There you go. You make stone pick, yes I do. Where do I place it? You put on magic red box, me get. There. <laughs> that was quick. <laughs> what happened? Oh, uh, the stones are fighting me. <laughs> do I have to mine them with the pickaxe? What do I need to do? Okay, I finally killed them. <laughs> Me hungry. You need food now? Well, that was uncalled for. <laughs> oh, the dumb stone is talking as well. Of course I talk, I'm a character in a diversity map. What is wrong with you? Me no like dumb stone. Stone break pick. Leave here or you'll be sorry and take your troublemaker friend with you. Me hungry now. Do I farm or what? Pig? Oh look there's pig. Me hungry, me eat pig. Poor pig. Pee pee poo poo no. Oh god, what's happening to pee pee poo poo? Apocalypse. Uh can I make a sword? I better make a sword. No, not button. Yeah, I'm gonna make a stone sword first. Okay, I can make a wooden pickaxe again. Why is he not attacking me? That's cool of you. Oh god, never mind. What attacked me actually? Does he have a ranged attack? Okay, I got a stone sword. Ah, uh, what? Do I need to hit the table? Okay, now I can hit you. I guess when he has pigs summoned, he becomes invincible. So at least he has a really small range, so that's what they can. Oh god. Pee pee poo poo army. Why do you turn against me now? Baby pee 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 poo poo. I'm sorry I have to kill you, but you leave me no choice. Come on, almost dead. Almost dead, come on. Oh god, I'm on fire now. They can. No, I'm gonna die. I hope he doesn't reach that health if, if I die. Because I'm gonna be pretty sad. Okay, I don't. And I keep the items as well. That's pretty cool. I have one battle star now. Just like Geralt of the team. Actually he has more, but he has one big one, so... Oh god, you have quite a lot of knockback, my guy. <laughs> Did people need to just fall off? Die, then. You monst. Oh look, that's a lot of pork. Bad pig dead. Wait, was that Technoblade? 
Did I just kill Technoblade? Player give food. Yes, okay. No, why not? Let him eat. That's all? Or do you need more? I guess you need more. Stop. Why should I stop? Oh god. Uh, these stone guys are gonna kill me. <laughs> Grand 1899 was slain by a chunk of stone. So, do I give you more food? Yeah. Why are you helping this big idiot break me? I mean, I just want the wool, not gonna lie. Do you need more food? Me no like them stone. Me want to smash. Wanna smash? Me need strong pick. Me need iron pick. Iron, you say? I've got your iron right here. Where's the iron, Mr. Stone? Oh, there it goes. Oh god, iron ore just killed me as well. At least I can one hit them. <laughs> but they can almost one hit me as well. Player, make me pick. Okay, I'll make you pick. Okay, I can make an iron pick finally. There you go. <laughs> Did it break again? Me hungry again. Wow, you eat a lot. Oh, well, why don't you taste this then? What's that? An actual zombie pigment. Why did his pork chop become green? Why did you eat the green pork chop? What's wrong with you? Can I destroy the spawner by the way? I think so. Okay, destroyed. And do I destroy the spawner as well? Yep. I warned you, you gave me no choice. Was this always here? No, right? Dumb stone, bad stone. Get lost, all of you. I mean, if you give me the wool, I will. Me smash, but me feel bad. Oh god, Steve is turning green as well. Me sick. Me need feel better. Well, don't worry, I'm a doctor, Steve. Cow, player get bucket, we need milk. Well, isn't that convenient? I get you sick and the cure just happens to appear the moment you need it. What's next? A bucket will just magically spawn when you need one? Oh yeah, it did actually. What? That isn't fair. A game object that is initially unreachable until it's necessary to progress gameplay. Actually, I could have crafted a bucket, so it wasn't exactly necessary, but I'll take it. There you go, have your milk. No, that's enough. Oh god, <laughs> no, it's a cow boss. Are those with our skulls? I'm scared oh. now. Armageddon. <laughs> um, <laughs> you got a beef with me? Oh god, I'm scared. Mom, please pick me up, I'm scared. How do I even kill that thing? <laughs> Calvinated whistle. These are pretty good pants, I have to admit. I don't even have a bow, what do I do? I'll burn those right through you. I'm sorry, but these pants are pretty good. What do I do? Do I shoot the cows back at him? I guess that's what I need to do. Like, like how you can do with gusts. Okay, yeah, I do shoot the cows back to him, in fact. It's not easy, though. You have to hit them right at the perfect moment. And I don't think you can hit him when he comes down to you. And he heals as well if he hits you. Not very epic. You can't hide forever, Armageddon. <laughs> Neil B for me. Come on, last one I think. Nice. That's the second time this week. Stone, no stop player. Smash time, break dumb stone. I'll smash you. Hey, that's my line. I've got a surprise for you. 
I brought all my cousins. What? Oh god, it's the INRs again. Not the INR. Oh my god. So am I supposed to mine these or what? Angry INR killed me again. Um, how do I stop this? Do I mine them or what? No, I cannot mine them. Do I maybe need a 9 pickaxe to mine these? Okay, I'll make a 9 pickaxe and try to mine those uh, ores when they come up. Oh, yep, that's what I need to do. Leave me alone, iron ores. Maybe I need a diamond. Maybe I need one of each or Did Steve say anything, by the way? Give diamond pick, okay. I didn't notice that. So diamond is what I need. Three diamonds. Oh my god, I almost had it. Diamonds, come on. Good. Where's the diamond? Come on. Oh, there it was. Uh, just let me mine the diamond in peace, please. Okay, please let me mine. Okay, good. Now let me craft my pickaxe in peace. There we go. Okay, kill me, of course. Why not? Take this. Steve smash pick no break. Stone break. No. Oh my god, R.I.P. Stone. You were like a father to me, Stone. What a small box. Is that a bedrock box? We give player pick, player turn. Oh, you got. Oh, you oh, gave me the diamond pick back. That's so nice of you, Mr. Steve. Uh, do I jump there? I guess. Oh, God. Basic parkour jumps, and I still cannot do them. Is that the wall? That's possibly the wall there. But I think there's gonna be at least one other boss. There has to be, I think. <laughs> Chicken. Oh, please don't kill me. Of course, I cannot make a simple jump. I hid in here so Steve wouldn't find me. Why would you help him? He is the bad guy here, not me. I kind of remember a chicken to be the final boss of previous maps as well. I'm not sure if it was diversity or not. Here I was minding my own business, hiding inside my stone base. Then some jerk starts griefing my hideout. Think about it, who's the one who started all of this? Chicken hide in box? Who kept wanting you to kill the innocent pig and steal milk from the poor cow? I try to protect them, give them powers to defend themselves, but I failed. Player killed chicken, be hungry. But I learned my lesson, I need your help. Toss me your time and pickaxe, I will stop Steve once and for all. No more innocent animals have to suffer from the selfish desires of Steve. Honestly, I don't trust this chicken. What happens if I press these buttons? Nothing. Do I kill chicken or do I give pickaxe to chicken? Honestly, sorry, I don't trust you, chicken. Jigarbuff, yes. Bummer, come on up. You can get up here from the boots. The boots of Steve. Okay, I'm gonna enter Steve now. The big giant boots. <laughs> the one Steve is wearing, it's pretty obvious. Yeah, I found it, don't worry. Oh, hey guys. Thanks. You just won me hundred dollars. That's okay. Uh, I really thought you'd side with the chicken. I still don't trust the chicken. Doesn't matter, I want the bet. Pay up, baby. Fine, but just remember, when you bet against your wife, you always lose. I... <laughs> you what? Choose your words wisely. I hope you have the wool for me. I love you. Just give them the wool, you dark. Yes, please do. Yes, of course. Here you go. Good job and stuff. Thank you very much. So guys, I think I just completed Diversity 3. Very epic gamer moment right here. In my opinion.
Oh god, what's happening now? <laughs> Just like in the beginning. <laughs> and you beacon appears. Oh, <laughs> I can fly up. Is that a parkour map? Is there gonna be another parkour branch? Oh, so where am I now? I guess I'm in the sky. Enderpearl. Let's see how good I am at enderpearling. Pretty good in my opinion. Oh, is this the the moon thing where I was at with the orange wool? Can I talk to the villager inside there? I don't think so. Oh, there you are. Do you have a name? Nothing. Authorized person only. What's happening? <laughs> oh, that was Roblox after all. Remember from that episode? Oh god, what have I done? Do I have to kill you? Okay, Roblox must die. Underpearl. Uh, did I have to do that or was that just an extra thing? I don't know. Let's see if I can land this. Yeah, pretty good. Oh yeah, I think I have to do a task before I can have an underpearl. So what do I have to do here? How do I enter this thing? What's this plus? Spawn point set, okay. Oh, so these are mini versions of the branches, I think. Like that was the orange branch and this is the arena branch. And I guess I have to kill all of these or what? Obviously the ceremonial squid. Oh my god, do I have to kill these with my bare hands? Oh, they die easily though. Not that bad. Creeper. Oh man. And look, I'm so powerful. I just killed them with my bare hands. Okay, I'll take this. So which branch is this? Oh, this is the trivia branch, I guess. Yep. Do I have to answer another trivia question? What was the very first correct answer back in the trivia branch? Yes. Arcumagnet, wait. That was a yes for sure. It's the one that asked me if I understood the question. Oh, this is the parkour branch, right? I remember this ship, the pirate ship. Yeah, this is this is a mixture of all the parkour maps. There was the ship, the B one, I think. That was the dragon one. That's the beanstalk and the train one. I remember all of these. Also, I see the checkpoint there, but I'll go set that. So I guess I need to climb up the beanstalk. But I don't think I can from here, so I guess I have to climb up the dragon skull thing. Yeah, now I have to jump on the beanstalk or the train. Yeah, I remember this one as well. This was the very, the very, very first parkour. No, I think the ship was the first. No, I'm pretty sure this was the first one. And it was pretty annoying, I remember it. Oh, I think I need to jump over there. Yep, probably. Okay, now up the beanstalk. Nice. Wait, what? 
Okay, I thought I have to climb back up, but no, I did the challenge and now I can get the ender part. This is the escape branch, I remember. Better set the spawn point. I guess I need to escape yet again. Do I go up here or there? Let's try here. No, no, okay, almost fell. Um, now what? Maybe I need to go, oh, frick. Maybe I need to go here first. Totality. Creeper, oh man. I remember this fuse puzzle. I need shears for this, first of all. Creeper, help me out. I don't know what I have to do. Oh, there's another door right here. I didn't see it. There are two doors. Oh, yeah, this one is empty. Though. Oh. Okay. That was it. Just a random anvil. This is weird. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I need shears anyway. Oh my god, there's a button here. I'm so dumb sometimes. Okay, so I think the green one goes here and here. Here, and I assume it keeps going here. And then this is the one. Yep. Okay, that's it, I guess. Nice. Which one, which map is this? Oh, this is the survival one, because there's the mushrooms. Oh, this is the Erahitra one, of course. I didn't even act, <laughs> I didn't even wear the Erahitra whips. Let's try that again. <laughs> There's the button. Which one is this? Is this the dropper map? I think it's the dropper map. Yeah, must be. Oh god. Okay. I remember this one. There's like a small hole over here. Yeah, I guess. No, I guess I'm stuck. Oh, there's water there. That's where I need to go, I think. No, almost, well, not exactly almost, but yeah. I think it's actually better to drop from here, yeah, probably. Still didn't make it. Nice. Made it. Uh, now what? Shadow of the Spruce Breaker, what? Okay. Okay, so this is the survival branch now. Anything inside here? <laughs> Do I need to get the items back again? And this is exactly how I remember it, except obviously there wasn't a melon boss here. What are these four blocks, I wonder? Anything in this chest? Nothing. Anything up this tree, I hope. <laughs> Did this become snowy because of the snow I gave that guy? <laughs> I think so. Zombie head can be placed on block of emerald. 
Okay, I need to find four heads, I assume. Oh, I'll set the spawn point, of course. Cactus. A splash potion of weakness. A wither skeleton skull. So there must be some hidden chest on the side here. Let's check again. Maybe it's somewhere here. Oh, there it is. Nice hiding place. And I assume somewhere behind this hill there's a hidden chest somewhere. Or maybe on top of it. Maybe not. Oh yeah, I remember this mine from the actual map. Where's the hidden chest? And there it is. Okay, I got them all. We did it, Reddit. Oh, wait, it wasn't a... What? What else do I need to do? Oh, do I need to kill okay. these guys? Yeah. What was that? I forgot what uh, branch that was. Oh, the puzzle branch, of course. <laughs> Let's see what it has to offer this time. Do I just kill zombies and that's it? I guess it has been overrun by zombies. What am I missing? I guess I need to keep spawning them until it's the correct color. Yeah, so this is purple. Maybe I need to get the zombie over here now. Yep. Nice. Better kill the zombie, by the way. So he doesn't mess anything up. Come on. Nice. Walk over it. Oh my god. Walk over it. There you go. I hope this works. Come on, this should work, right? Oh god, man. Why? This is so stupid. Come on. There we go. Is that also a map or was... Oh yeah, this is the boss battle branch. And then that was the introduction branch. Steve versus Big Chicken. Schlatt is not gonna be happy about this. What do I do? Oh, I climb up the chicken, of course. Oh god, I have to summon the wither. Stone Junior. That's it. Did I kill the Stone Junior? Can I even go down? It seems like I'm trapped. Did I just get trapped inside here? Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, I guess not. I guess I'm just dumb. Okay, now for the introduction map. Okay. Oh, hello everyone. Diverse Detats. Oh, for some reason, there's a grand dating 99 and player. I guess there was one time when it didn't connect to the internet, and that's why it got recorded as player instead of grand dating 99. But I think it should be the total of each for mine, so like I died 33 times, 
I got 67 kills, so I got more kills than that, so that's pretty good. Some nice music by the way. <laughs> pretty epic, the split. Oh, these are the diversity tree creators. Thanks guys, very epic map that you've made. You've done it, you've actually done it. The monument is finally complete. And this is a dream come true. You truly are a hero. Well, thank you. So we have one last gift for you. Let's see what that is. But you must tell us which challenge did you enjoy the most. Uh, that's difficult to answer. Ah yes, it has arrived. Take your prize and your journey will be complete. I would say maybe the trivia was the one I enjoyed the most. Dirt. <laughs> of course I get dirt as the reward. Hey, you're finally awake. Hey, you. You're finally awake. You sleep with dirt? That's kind of weird. Alright guys, I'll get the tents. Just pick up your stuff and head to the RV. I'll give you a hand with the tents, Jig. Cool, we'll be good. Head back to the RV then. Back to the start. Uh, so where do I go now? Where's the RV, guys? I guess I'll just follow the path. Hey there. A scary dream last night sounded like you were falling to your death over and over. Ha ha ha. Are you insulting me? Thanks for coming out. It was nice to meet you. We all should definitely hang out again sometime. Okay, so basically Diversity 3 was all just a dream and I was in reality just camping with these guys. Okay then. I heard they were selling this place to tear it down and build a golf course. Ah well, it was fun while it lasted. Hey sleepyhead, we already loaded up the leftover food, but you can head back to the van and wait there if you like, shouldn't be long. Oh, there's the van. And there's a map as well. Welcome to Easy Dreams Private Camp, sweet dreams. Oh, there's Q Magnet. Ready to get out of here, hop in, the other should be here shortly. Diversity 3 Okay, that was legitimately a very good map though. Memes aside, like every little detail was so well made. Like, I stopped getting impressed almost, but every character they made was perfectly animated. Small details everywhere. It really shows though the effort that they put into this map. So very good reviews from me, 10 on 10. There were some difficult, annoying branches of course, but difficulty is part of the game after all, so can't really complain about that either. Like even this end scene, so well made, like, I don't even know how they did this. I, well, I can kind of know, just teleporting the player over and over, but <laughs> it looks like a video almost, rather than Minecraft. It was just a very high quality map, so good job again, guys. Also, thank you guys for watching, and for tuning in with every episode that I made. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed playing it. Like legit this could almost pass as a standalone game. It had so much content in it and I spent a lot of hours on it, definitely over 10 hours.
so thanks for watching and goodbye guys to the next one